Time now for the mix. We start off on a very sweet note. So a mom was a little bit confused when her son kept asking for two lunches. Yeah. And she came to find out that the reason was actually because he noticed that his friend didn't have enough money. Not to because buy. he was greedy. No, his the friend didn't have enough lunch to buy a full lunch. The friend was just buying fruit cups. So huh. her she started packing two lunches for her son, who shared them. Ah, oh, so he was just being a nice kid. Correct. Well, it turns out the mother of that student that he was sharing with found out, offered to pay her for the missing lunches, and rather than accept the money, Dylan's mom actually turned it into a larger fundraiser to cancel all of the debts of all of the students right. that owed money for lunch. And a nice note along with it. Yeah. Um, here's something that could have made lunch for the entire basketball team of that school or and then some the largest lobster look at that that is Ooh, like that's a monster that is huge looks fake that's like the size of gary coleman that that okay so this is in bermuda now the big joke is that hurricane nicole which just passed through um kind of swept in this uh, monster lobster it is 14 pounds um wow. sadly you can keep your butter away. It was released back into the water. <laughs> How uh, bummed were you? I was really bummed. I was like, <laughs> wow, that is huge. Uh, now, I, I don't think they're serving lobster here at this particular uh -huh. McDonald's. However, they were serving up a very nice surprise for an old patron. Nadine Baum used oh. to frequent McDonald's on a regular basis with her son before she was too crippled by arthritis to show up. Well. The folks at the local Mickey D's found out that she was turning 100. They decided to do something nice for her. They threw her this surprise party. Her son brought her in. Aww. They had this big celebration, and they have offered her free meals for life. Well, that's quite a gamble, McDonald's. <laughs> How do you see you do that for your kid's first birthday? <laughs> That'd be a lot of her. That'd, That'd be, be a lot of meals. Good for her. Uh, beautiful, cute picture here. Um, Take a look at this little koala. Oh. It's at a sanctuary there who loves belly rubs and who really doesn't <laughs> like belly rubs. So the photographers, Mandy Lee, made the video in hopes of uh, educating people on the importance of caring for and protecting koalas. And I like how when they stop I stroking, what, exactly. the koala moves his hand like, hey, hey. Hey, more. Let's go. Keep it up. <laughs> Keep it up. Oh, uh, man. Apparently, they all have their own personalities, koalas. Who knew? This one is.